comes out, we got the snow. It's got going it. down, Dawsey. It's going down. It's going down. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, big. The There's the patch, boys. All right, let's set it up. Yeah. All right, guys. I got to hit you with an unfortunate mid video breakdown right now, but hopefully we can make it entertaining. The last 20 minutes of the hike, heading back to the cars, my GoPro somehow followed a six step procedure in my pocket to reformat the entire card and lose every single file that I recorded from the entire trip. Thankfully, we still have heaps of other footage and I can at least explain to you guys how life changing this was and how when we woke up in the morning exhausted from hiking four miles through the night, we continued to hike three miles to a new camp spot, set up all of our gear, and then start another multiple mile hike up the most massive mountain I've ever climbed through crazy terrain to eventually make it to the top and see the fountain of youth for the first time in my life. Now, we have enough footage from the other cameras, Dossie's camera, Tim Humphreys, my camera, Mito helping film, the video is still gonna be epic but it's gonna be different. I'm not gonna have my full-blown real-time reactions to seeing the Fountain of Youth, but it made me realize that there's something special about this place that is deeper than just the snowboarding. And for some reason, the universe did not allow us to actually capture the camping, the swimming, the one-on-one -on -one real-time take of what it's like to hike 20 miles through the woods to an absolute sacred location, and that's okay. It did allow us to keep the bangers. Tim does have an insane amount of footage and this video is still going to be as epic as I could possibly make it. And the drive for going back next year and making this even sicker and even more epic is through the roof. So I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. It's what I could do with what I had and I'm grateful that I even had that. We've already been hiking for like two days, but we're going up there. Summit this bitch. Yeah? Good morning guys. We are tuning into you live right now from the Fountain of Youth. If you've been watching the past couple videos, you saw us hike treacherously for literally the past two days to make it up here. And it looked kind of crazy. It's got a bunch of ice in the middle. So the legends who literally discovered this are trying to fish hook the icebergs out of the middle right now. And we're doing what we can to actually make it so that it's pristine, rideable, but this is all time, this is insane. 
Heaviest hike of my entire life. 100% worth it. Knees about to give out, but we're gonna gear up and we're gonna just make this happen. So frothed out right now. How That's sick. How's your neck, bub? Neck's great. It's, hey, it's chilling. You have to just keep coming back. In one year, exactly. it, line, it lines up just like yeah. so golden. Flying. You got hammers. Oh. Y'all got like ten clips or some yeah. shit. That shit yeah, right there. Bootable. Oh, I can't do that. <laughs>
watching a wild Casey Willax out in his natural habitat in the mountains above the lake. GoPro in hand. I don't know what's even keeping me like standing up. I know. Right now, I'm like so fried. Dude, the shoot was sick though. It goes. <laughs> what? Oh, got it. Oh. Got it, got it. oh, my God. Ah! <laughs> that was sick. <laughs> so rowdy. Huh? Oh, yeah. Woo Talk about this, though. Bam. Right here. The neck. Oh, my God, dude. Well, let's get that neck to the campsite. Oh, yeah. I'm <laughs> successful, Mish. Oh yeah, let's get some puppy cam in here. What's up, dog? Oh. Paco. Paco is a legend. Yeah. This little dog just champed it all the way up. He hikes up and then gets packed down. Yeah. But he yeah, does, yeah. He does hike up. Right? Made it to the campsite. Been waiting for this for two days. Oh. My God. And here we are. <laughs> We're dreaming. We love to secure it. You love to see Big Dossie. Yeah. Yeah, You love to see El Carne. El Carne. Me win. You can mess with the photos, it would have been like. trail fresh off a nap Casey Willax what what do you have to say to the people I think we only got like a mile left <sighs> pretty we're psyched make it, dude we're gonna make pretty it. psyched on that single digit amount of miles just woke up from a nice little nap yeah right there bam <sighs> this was absolutely psychotic I don't know what the we were thinking <laughs> there's no words bro you can't even capture it <laughs> uh, what were we doing <laughs> I'm like so fried this backpack sucks <laughs> but, uh, we scored Calling it 20. Calling it 20, 20 mile, 25 mile round trip. I don't think they're taking into account the elevation. <laughs> I could hike. 
this far. Nor did I even know what I was getting myself into. But when you're just out there and you gotta get back, you're gonna do the unthinkable. In this case, it's literally just walking. Oh my gosh. That was the most rewarding thing I've ever done in my life. Home stretch, baby. Coming in last place. Jim, the janitor, jump for you. He's just cleaning it up. Wow! Yeah. Yeah. Good job. Bam. 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 Bam.